Hi everyone, welcome back with another video. In today's video, we will be covering the removing of physical volume, volume group, and logical volume. But before we get started, please to be careful. This operation will wipe out all the data from the disk. So please don't perform it on systems that have critical production data or sensitive data. And if it's so, please make sure to take a backup of those data before perform the LVM removal operation. With all that being said, let's jump into the demonstration. As you can see here in the terminal, I'm connected to the, uh, the server, Linux server. So also using SSH connection. So the first command, let me just first uh, check the VG, the VGS data uh, VG. This one, what we need to remove. As we can see here, we have the data VG. So let me also check the LVS. Let's check the logical volumes. We can see here we have uh, two logical volumes. Let me also check uh, DF like this one we can see how we can see here that those uh, logical volumes are mounted on the file system so we need to unmount them so the first step to remove everything we need to unmount so we can do u mount like this then data and logs like this and then after we uh, unmount them let me just check again as we can see here we don't have let's check again also with mount a grip dash i data we can see here we don't have right now any uh, logical volume mount to the file system so now we can clear then the next step we can right now remove the logical volumes let's remove both of them right now so the command to remove is uh, lv remove okay then dash f to force the remove then dev data vg then data and again also dev data and then log both of them together okay now let's do lvs we can see here we don't have the data and log, log logical volumes okay now let's do the vgs Again, we can see here the volume, the data uh, volume group uh, still here, but we don't have any logical volume assigned or created for this uh, data, vo data volume group. So we have only one physical volume. So how we can right now remove this one? We can do remove and uh, yeah, remove VG remove like this, then the data VG like this. Okay so once we remove this one we can do the vgs again we can see the data vg is not right now available anymore so it's removed now after we remove the logical volume and we re also remove the volume group now we need to remove the physical volume so we can do bvs to see what we have here physical volumes we can see here we have three physical vo uh, four physical volumes so we need to clear all of them so what we can do we can do bv bv remove again with dev sd uh, sdb1 dev sdb2 dev and SD, uh, sdc1 and dev sdd1 like this all of them one shot okay nice so successfully wipe so the data wiped out right now let me just do bvs again uh, bvs we can see here right now we don't have those uh, physical volumes related to the lvm nice after we remove the physical volumes now we need to format those disks okay so f disk dev sd sdb sdb sorry like this okay so let's print p we can see here we have two partitions so let's remove i will press d to delete enter then i will hit enter again and then again just to see yeah i still have another partition let's hit d again 
enter then everything is wiped so let me just p so list again yeah i don't have any other or further um partitions so i will hit w and then i will hit enter again so as you can see here i right now wrote everything that's i uh, delete all the partitions so let's do the same for the other disks let's start with c let me just p to print out yeah i have one partition so let's delete with d and then i will hit uh, enter then p again just to uh, list yeah i don't have any further um, partitions so i can hit w and then hit enter to write down the changes let me just again also clear let's do the same for d and be careful for this one uh this operation if disk will wipe out everything okay so let me uh print n uh, sorry uh, d but before d let me just put p to see. yeah i have only one partition so let me just also um put d and then after d i will put p again as you can see we, uh, we, don't, we don't have any additional partition so we can right now write the date the change uh, to the disk yeah everything is fine so let's check uh, let me just clear the screen so i will do like this i will right now just check if i have uh let's say um the do the disk right now if have any partition or not we can see here right now everything back again to the origin so that's that's it so as you can see here here we are completely remove everything and return the system back to the origin to the same side to the same uh, state so that's it i hope you enjoy this video uh, see you next video thank you for watching take care bye